Aluminum. Stuck a piece of lead. That's a good sign. I don't know what it is. Like a button. No, a coin. Or, or it's a button, but it's got a uh, a bust on it. Odd. It won't work. Unless that's just the flaking. Might be some aluminum. <laughs> oh, piece of rolled up lead. This was pretty deep. Don't know what it is. Looks like it was round or cylindrical. But looks old. Found another piece of lead. Looks like pewter, actually. Got another flat button. Colonial. Found another flat button. Broken button. That's a big shank on that. I think this was one of those, had one of those, those paste jewels with that glass on it. I think. Or may have wood. Nice pewter button. See the mold seam. Nice thick chain. So it's probably too windy to hear, but I see a perfectly poor square, poorly drained area. And I didn't, I didn't hear any iron in there, but right when I came off of it, scattered probably, you know, 20 yards behind me is all the iron. So I bet you this was the foundation. I bet you if I dig down, there's some brick there and the house may have fallen over and then over the years of plowing it has brought the the rest of the house this way it's just a theory 
just a little buckle piece right on the edge of where I said that the little square the house was not little but big square uh, just a little buckle piece uh, I probably won't show all the little teeny finds so hopefully I so I decided to dig out right where it got dark right at the very corner of this little dark square and I'm hitting oyster shell and some brick so it either may be a trash pit but it, it's perfectly square so I'm thinking this is a corner of some foundation picking up so I don't know if you can hear me but what I don't have is permission to dig this out so you know I can probably go to the homeowner and ask but right now I'm not gonna do it because I'm on the main road and I don't want him to drive by and ask why I'm digging enormous holes in his field so maybe that's what I'll do when I'm done just gridding the area I'll go ask the homeowner and see if I can just dig out a little section. I do have a little tarp in the back of my truck for these scenarios, so we'll see. Pretty tiny little tomback. I'm using second grade intuition. So wherever that dark line, that little uh, where I think that house was, I'm just hunting right in front of it facing the water so got a nice signal here Brass. Well, uh, might be something good. Looks like it's got little leather hooks on the back here. It's not big. But, so I'm not going to fold it open right now. I'm going to go home and brush it off, clean out the mud, and see if I see anything on the face of it. It's really too small and square to be anything, I think, important, but it might be a little tag or something. Another piece of pewter, like a spoon. Sorry for the wind. scalloped. Boy. Either it was the end of a spoon, I don't know, or, or it looks like a leather ornament with the head, the little loop here with a, I don't know, just guessing. 
tiniest cut coin I've ever found. It's teeny. other coins in here so I'm just concentrating in front of that house It's a copper about the size of a Virginia half penny. But it looks toasty. I don't know. I'll clean it off when I get it. Just a button with a cool design. Found a broken pewter button. Dug a nice tom back. Probably gonna leave here soon. Been here a couple hours. Didn't do too bad. Found a little small piece of cut silver. Found a copper coin. About a dozen buttons. Some leather ornaments. And whatever that little brass sheet was with the with the leather hooks on the back. We'll figure out what that is when I get home. Here are my finds. Found a cool chisel. Part of a hoe. Some big little brass piece. That brass sheet thing. Um, it's really nothing. And a big uh, piece of lead. And a pile of buttons in here, including some of those big pewters. A thimble. Whatever, and then found this copper, which I think is a Virginia half penny. It's that size. Um, and then this cut silver. It's tiny. So, not a bad day. Not a bad couple hours. It's just so dang windy, it's not fun. Uh, but it is fun finding relics. All right, bye. So here are my finds. Found this cool chisel. Um, some really cool pewter buttons. Here's another pewter button with a design on the front. Some other flat buttons, tombag button, uh, some lead, nice 
small caliber uh, lead round balls. I got a Virginia half penny, only minted in 1773. And I got this super tiny cut silver. Um, you know, I thought it was a, I've never seen a cut half real cut like that, but um, I sent a picture to my buddy and he seems to think it's a cut William the Third sixpence, which might make more sense. Uh, so didn't, didn't kill it, kill it, but some good finds for a, for a, just a spur of the moment permission. Thanks for watching.